The skies will be blue once again. Just today, we're still fighting this haze that we still have across Metro Detroit. Uh, sunrise will be at 557 this morning, sunset 913 PM. And this is where we're headed. We're forecasting a high of 85. So the, so far this morning, we've been down to around 65. Average this time of year, 81 and 62. So the record 97, and we're not going to be anywhere near records anytime soon. For downtown Detroit, it's 68. It's fairly dry. The dew points at 52. Winds from the northeast at about 5 to 10 miles an hour. And we have numbers in the 60s across the entire area. A few clouds, you can kind of see them in the high level clouds and also the haze that's out there. All courtesy of a storm system to our south where this is going to be uh, pushed to the south and it's going to stay there. Blocking patterns in place, so not a lot of change between today and yesterday. Sunshine remains. Unfortunately, that haze and that smoke remains as well. But once we get towards Thursday and Friday, we are expecting to push it out some. The bad news is that clouds I'm thinking are going to creep in on Thursday. So even though technically the blue skies will be back, it'll be tough seeing them because the clouds move in. Just some stray showers, maybe even a rumble of thunder, a possibility north of Detroit. Outside of that, the easterly flow will keep you cooler in areas like Monroe, Mount Clemens, and Port Huron. Otherwise, going with a high temp of around 85 for today, so not bad at all. For tonight into tomorrow morning, we're getting warmer and warmer during our nights and mornings. 64 in the city of Detroit as the humidity slowly climbs. It will take a dip for the middle of the week, but the muggy meter will spike later this week. That sets the stage for showers and storms to return, and it appears we'll have scattered chances on Friday. I'm thinking Saturday looks drier, but Sunday we're expecting showers and storms to kind of pick up. Maybe they could be strong, so we'll keep an eye on that. And they could linger into next Monday with temperatures holding steady in the 80s.